What is going on everybody? Welcome back to part 3 of Forza Horizon Motorsport 2. We today are heading... Oh. Something new I've organised for this year's festival is the Horizon Bucket List. A list of things you've just got to do while you're at the festival. Okay, I've had cars like this placed all over Europe. Inside the car you'll find a set of instructions, a challenge. If you only complete one thing this summer, make it the bucket list. Right, okay, so we've got the bucket list to take up. We were going to go and race some fighter jets, but we'll do that straight after we have taken on the Koenigsegg challenge. Where we've got to drive the coin exec as fast as possible. I, I assume that's all I have to do. Let's go. Beat the speed target. So what is the speed target, I say? 125 miles an hour. Okay, let's do this. This is a nice car. Let's have a quick look inside. Oh, God, those stripes are... <laughs> let's rewind that. Those stripes are really distracting in the center there that you can see. Uh, but let's have a quick look at the inside, the interior. Very nice, very swanky. Uh, I'm going to get out of that cockpit view, though. <laughs> Because driving this fast is very, very hard. Oh my god. This thing is so hard to control. Ha! <laughs> what speed am I meant to be doing? I don't know, but it just said get as fast as possible. So that is exactly what I'm doing. Can I cut? I think I can cut up this up this hill. Um, I'm not 100% sure. Oh, that's not looking good. Oh. No, okay. You don't go up that hill, guys. Let's go back. I just, like, destroyed a coin exec. <laughs> uh, let's go a little bit further. All right, that's perfect. We've got to take this corner now on the right, and then it there's another corner. So we've got to. How are we gonna? Is it? Oh, it actually is gonna stick. Oh, this doesn't feel right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it as fast as possible. Yes, that's success. Down, but they won't all be this easy. Two hundred and ten miles an hour. We hit there. That's the first part of the bucket list complete. That was pretty insane. <laughs> Pretty intense. I didn't think I'd be taking a coin exec on my road uh, home. But now we're off to go fight or destroy or overtake or beat a fighter jet by the looks of it. Or three, actually. It looked like there were three in the photo. So let's head over, continue our way through the amazing vista and get over to that point. Let's get back into our Z4. You look like you enjoyed that. You I did. Do it again as many times as you like. Ah, oh, thank you. That's very kind. Just borrow your queen exec and see how fast you can get. Now this Z4 seems utterly slow. Come on, Z4. Show them what you're made of. You can do this. So our destination is fast approaching. It's only four. I'm looking at the map, hence why I just crashed. Uh, four kilometers away. We're still, we're still all right. I haven't actually fully crashed. Yeah, landed it. Nice. It looks like it's at the top of the hill. And we got kangaroo, so we got a, a few points for doing kangarooing. Turn right. In 200 meters, turn left. Left. Break, break, break. Left. Nice little great air there, as you can see. Come on, Volkswagen. This is a bit like the speed trap challenge you did earlier. Except instead of flying through a high speed, you need to maintain the high speed through the speed zone. Oh, I hate those kind of speed cameras. Okay, so this is a uh, continuous speed camera zone where you usually only have to stay at like 50 miles an hour or something. But on this, it's like, be as fast as you can. So just always try and remember when you're in the game and when you're actually driving because this could go catastrophically bad. Did I do well? Yeah. New personal best, obviously, because I hadn't done it before. I think the great thing about this game is even when you're driving along like we are now to a destination, there's little challenges that always are popping up. You always feel like you're progressing even though... Meters, turn right. Sorry, Satnav. You're not actually doing anything, if that makes sense. You're just driving to your destination. Let's see if you can... Turn right. Oh, no! Damn it. That drift did not go very well. Right, we need to go right. And I think we are then going to be there. Turn left. Turn left. Whoa, mountains. No, we didn't hit it. We're okay. We just hit some signs. All right, here we are at our destination. Let's reverse up into it. Nice. So, this is what it's about. I think we're going to be racing some fighter jets or some, like, cool flying things. Not 100% sure yet. 
Beat the display team. Oh, a Ferrari. Very nice. So we have to race them in our Ferrari. Alright, let's go. So they have a lot more speed, but they basically have to take like 10 times the corner. Eds, go, 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 go! Let's have a look inside this Ferrari quickly. Very nice. I just wanted to see roughly what it looks like. Oh my god. That's really eerie having them like blaze past you like that. If you're wearing headphones. Oh my god. And they really come down low as well. Come on, we can do this. Never did I think I was going to be fighting fighter jets. <laughs> yeah, drift, 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 drift. No, damn it. I can never, I can start the drift off and then it stops. I try and put even more power out to kind of like push the rear out a little bit more, but it never seems to work. Are we in front? Ooh, I think they're just in front. Oh, no, 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 no. Rewind, rewind. I hit that wall quite hard. All right, as soon as we go here, we need to break. And there, yes, we use that wall actually to our advantage then. Ooh, I think we might just be ahead. I hope it's the whole team we have to beat and not just the first guy, because otherwise it'd be a little bit unfair. But I think we're literally just ahead. Yes, there we go. Way ahead by like a whole millisecond. <laughs> go, go, go. Come on, Ferrari. Listen to the engine through here. Yeah, echoing off the walls. Oh no, they got ahead of us. Oh my god, I got confused. The roar of their engines sent me off. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Ferrari. Here they come. Oh, easily. Beat them easily there. That was cool. You could see them coming from a distance. Yes, they're ahead again. See, they go ahead now, but they have to make that massive, massive corner while we can kind of cut in here quite nicely. They come sometimes behind the actual finish line, though. That was a nice little drift. Awesome drift. Ultimate drift, even. This is going to be close. Photo finish. Yes, we must have just nailed it. First place. Oh, my God. Pretty spectacular stuff, huh? I never thought you'd beat them. I didn't either. Point th literally, perfectly, point 0.3 of a second is what we beat them by. How many did we get? We got 7,000. Oh, you can keep the car. Keep the Ferrari. Okay, yeah, that's, that's obviously what he was going to do. Just after that one race, you can keep a whole brand new, well, not brand new, but uh, 2003 Ferrari. That's probably worth still about 50, well, probably 50, 40 grand or something. And that's it. We've destroyed them. So we did really well there against those air people. Um, air people. The air display team. What trophy did we just unlock? What achievement? Oh, no. It's just somebody else's online. I thought we unlocked an achievement for doing that. Uh, but that was pretty awesome. It was probably one of the coolest things that we've done so far in this. Hopefully, there's more of those. And uh, we even race different things. No, Tim. I'm not going to be driving. But the guys that will are the best we have at the festival. Come on, the finale is going to be the event of the summer. All right, that's terrific. Uh, where are you now? Oh, it's a shame. We're just about to cruise down to Nice. <laughs> All right, we're about to do the second leg of the road trip. You ready? We are going to La Bella Nice, the beautiful city. Come on, let's go. La Bella Nice. All right, so we're about to head off then to La Bella Nice. What are we going to be driving? What are we going to be driving? Ferrari, yes, we're in our Ferrari. We can have a better view of the hey, cockpit. Just been added to your radio nice. You can now tune into Hospital Records Radio. Hospital Records? Why would I want to listen to that? Radio off when I've got like a Ferrari engine right here in my ears. I wouldn't want to listen to Hospital Records. That sounds so depressing. And then next is probably Elevator Records. I don't know. Anyway, let's race our way down. That's cool. Look at that on the right. The cars you pass on here are pretty nice. We're 10 kilometers away. Uh, taking the road across the 
edge of this island. Oh man, he just clipped me. He nearly, nearly hit me off. In my brand new Ferrari. Whoa! Oh, look at that. That silver nearly chrome. Looks pretty amazing. Turn left. Oh, turn left here. Ah, uh, cutting across. I'm sorry. <laughs> Off-roading in a Ferrari. It's probably the most crazy festival ever. Oh, look at that cute little car. Is that an old BMW or something? It looks like an old BMW. Not 100% sure, but we didn't get quite a good glance at it. I've noticed, though, that there's hardly any texture pop-ins or, like, you know, distance rendering. It's all really smooth. There was a little actual um, shortcut there. don't know if you saw that. You could drive through someone's garage. Should be coming off on the left any second now. And you can cut down there. Yeah, that was actually a shortcut. Damn, I should have should have taken advantage of that. Saw it too late. As we roll through a town. I wonder what this town is thinking. Just all of a sudden you've got Ferraris, Lambos, Veyrons, Bugattis. Uh, those McLaren P1s just like rolling past. Oh, ow. Some really rich kids have come to town to play with their toys. In 400 meters, turn left. Oh, we're okay. Oh, hit the cafe stuff. Go, go, go. Sideswipe plus a thousand points. Oh, we've got a Veyron to play with. And we destroy him. <laughs> Annihilated. Oh, ow, no. What? That dip completely set me off then. I was steering perfectly. And the dip takes you and really mucks up your steering. As it would do if you were driving this speed. Oh my god. I'm going to crash soon. I know it. Let's go to the cockpit. Oh. Roundabout? roundabout? No, we're okay. Oh my god. Right, I'm getting back into this view. Left. Oh, I thought that was two sides of the road. Turn left. Obviously not. Road discovery. We discovered some new roads. Turn left. I love it how there's really open areas, big open plains, and you've got these tight, compact cities with really like, you know, you've got the bigger roads like this, and then you've got the small roads around the alleys, which is pretty cool. So it's a real mix of driving, and hopefully when you uh, can have other cars like little Mini Coopers... Oh god, I'm sorry. Wow. <laughs> that worked out alright. Come back here. Break. Yeah. Get off the road, Ford KA. And here we go, arriving at the next festival. Our next destination, which is Nice, Messina. Senna? I think that's how you say it. I'm not 100% sure. And we got an achievement. What is it? Welcome to Nice. Welcome to Nice. No, it's Nice. It's spelled nice, though. Maybe it's a nice place. But they couldn't call it Nice because that's a word, so they just called it Nice. Welcome to Nice. Like I said earlier, the championship you enter is determined by the car you're driving. That means I've signed you up for the Nice Modern Supercars Championship. Now, if you fancy something different, though, no problem. The auto show is now open, so you can buy yourself a different car, then come back here to sign up for that car's championship. 
awesome. So we can now go and buy other cars and explore other races, but that is all we're going to be able to do today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. We got quite a lot done, and it was a pretty epic tour and an epic battle against some fighter jets. If you'd smash the like button down below for me, that would be absolutely awesome, and comment on any other cars you want me to get. Now we can go into the auto store or the auto show, whatever he called it. But until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. Peace out.